Hi, I'm Steve, 84XT. Welcome to Ham Radio Portable and welcome to Field Day 2024. We're back out at Ellerslie Park again. This is our second year. Uh, it's a great place for Field Day because lots of public involvement that, that we see come through during the day. So it should be a lot of fun. Well, it's early in the morning, so let's get things set up. Let's ride on into the park. And I have heard they've got something new up here this year. And I see it already. The park has built an observation tower on the highest point in the park. Man, that's. Here it's about 70 foot to the platform level, spiral staircase. Uh, let's take a closer look at that. Let's walk over and take a closer look at this observation tower that they built. This thing is really massive when you take a close look at it spiral staircase all the way to the top. I have been up at one time and I think I counted 79 or 80 steps. Uh, it's totally open to the public. Door just opens up and a neat spiral staircase and a good healthy climb to the top. I'm not going to climb it today because it's early in the morning at field day and I don't want to scrub a lot of energy off because we've got a, a lot more setting up to do. But uh, I can see uh, me climbing this with the HD and trying to make some simplex contacts in the future. Beautiful park here in Harris County. Lots of uh, amenities, great bathrooms over here, picnic areas. They've got a like a house you can rent and uh, air conditioning and all that. Wouldn't that be great today with the temperature being near 100? But our area, yeah, we've got some folks already here. It's going to be this picnic shelter which we used last year. And we've got all the area from that picnic shelter all the way around. Everything on the left side of this road. And we've already got the banner up. And wow. Our communication trailers up there so let's get this thing parked and uh, start setting things up this is our club communication trailer here and the park has afforded us all the area from the exit here and we've got our antenna ropes already in the trees we did that yesterday afternoon and good set of trees all along this side perfect for stringing up for three stations and then our little picnic shelter is at the other end so this should be good it's early in the morning we're waiting for the troops to show up and we'll get get things going let's take a look at our three stations here. Of course the Honda generators are live and in action and they're running our our trailer here. It's got air conditioning for the uh, CW guys uh, trying to keep them cool. Nobody else has got, got AC. But they're running a uh, extended ZEP antenna. This ladder line here going up to center connector there. We've got this thing strung way over into a tree. I know that we've got it about 80 foot high. And I think it's doing real well for them. I haven't heard any 
cleaning complaints. And they also got a 20 meter dipole that they wanted put up and we put that up for them trying to cater to their needs. Honda generator's been running all day. We're glad to see this sun go down a little bit. I think it got up to 97 here in Georgia during the daytime and uh, that's quite hot. We've been in it all day. Let's go in and look at the CW guys and let's see what they're up to. Okay, it can be a bit noisy in here because we're not going to get the air conditioner on. He just turned it. He just turned it. Hey, we got Jeff that's coming in. Okay. Pretend okay, like you're operating. Pretend okay, like you're operating. Oh, okay. These guys have been operating all day long. There's no, no pretending. We just, uh, yeah. I forgot what air conditioner felt, feels like. <laughs> What is the setup of your FT1000 MP? FT1000 MP? FT1000 MP, that's an old radio. Yeah, I know, I picked it up out of John's car and it's quite heavy. Yes. You want to put it on speaker so you can hear No, I'm not on speaker or anything. I'm just kind of looking at y'all's okay. setup. And, uh, they run in pairs in here. Sometimes they'll be running solo. And, uh, hey. Jeff, we appreciate what y'all doing for us. As we walk on down the road, this uh, first pop up here you come to will be our sideband station, and we've got nobody operating right now. So the uh, second station is our digital guys. They've been a little bit busier today, today than I than they ever been have been, and. Further on down is the uh, the go to station, the get on the air station, and they have been quite busy. We've had a lot of new people come out and uh, operate that station, but uh, for an antenna on the uh, sideband station, we've got a good one, and it's been working really well. Uh, ZS6BKW is one of built and did a video it's actually the one I did the video on and uh, we've got it up at about I'd say about 50 foot maybe and uh, stretched out good and it's been a uh, it's been operating well quite pleased with it let's walk down here and chat with the digital guys they're running a lot of FT8 Our digital guys have been been at it. Yeah, I think I just blew it up. Oh, we got a malfunction. Yeah. So it looks like we're restarting. Yeah, we bounced it already. Bounced it already. Right. Oh. What are we running here? Running the Kenwood again? Yes, sir. Right. Kenweed. The Kenweed. <laughs> Let's let them re reboot this thing in your uh, Watch them make a contact. And another Honda generator uh, running both the digital station and the go to station to get on the air station. And this place has been a busy spot today, it seems like. Okay, the folks running the uh, station are just turning it loose. And uh, they're comfortable running it on their own. A nice radio. GX10 with that screen. Really nice. And one and one for the software. Run a different call sign for the go to station. That'd be a full FIZ. The go to station is running off this infed half wave we set up for them. Go into top of this tree here. So it's been a good antenna for them. Beautiful setting over here at the Sellersley Park. I mean, it's very pretty this afternoon. Got the lake. And it's very quiet out here. The wind has kind of died off some. And uh, 
nice fountain out there towards the center going. Just a perfect uh, spot to have our field day. Let's take a look at the VHF UHF station. The sun's kind of going down, so not generating much power. Randy, looks like you're trying to generate the uh, anti-mosquito yeah. city in here. Were you able to do anything with the uh, VHF and UHF station? I made a couple contacts on six. never know what the band's going to do on six, but uh, was this tent pretty cool? Or did it work out for you? Uh, it was kind of hot. That's what I thought when I looked over here. You had the, the shade, but you was blocking the breeze. So, anyways, we'll let you get back and listen. We're coming up to the gray line, so maybe you'll, yeah. you'll get some action on it. I hope so. Okay, let's get a shot of the hospitality table with all the goodies. Well, what is this goodie? Somebody said they was going to buy it. Still for sale? I guess it's still for sale. Still for sale. <laughs> three VHF and three UHF, so uh, maybe somebody will hit me up and uh, want to buy it. But anyways, that's hospitality today. Okay, let's walk down here where all the action is and I don't think they rang the dinner bell somebody was supposed to ring the dinner bell when the barbecue got here nobody rang the dinner bell it's been here for a long time okay no all right let's see what let's we'll see what the barbecue looks like Let's see what that plate looks like. All right. That looks good. Okay. This is where all the action is, so let's, uh, I guess it's time for me to dig in. I copy one Delta, North Central Florida. QSL, 73, good luck. North 73. North, just North Florida. CQ Field Day, CQ Field Day, this is Whiskey 4, Charlie Victor North Yankee. Central Whiskey 4, Charlie Victor Yankee Central calling Florida. CQ Field Day. Charlie like 1, Echo Lima Delta. Again, again, please. I copy Kilo Charlie, Kilo Charlie. Kilo Charlie, Got you that time. I copy Kilo Charlie 1, Echo Lima Delta. Please copy 3 Alpha, Gulf Alpha. QSL, copy 1 Delta, November Hotel. 1 Delta, November Hotel. Thank you so much, 73. 73. CQ Field Day, CQ Field Day. This is Whiskey hey, 4, Charlie Victor Yankee. Left Charlie Victor Yankee. 10 more minutes left in Field Day. On this last day of Sunday, so they're going to the wire. Alpha Charlie 3, Mike Bravo, please copy 3. We also put this antenna up. This is a, one of the 10 meter J pole antennas, and uh, we can use it at old 10 instead of the ZS6. It's, uh, it's performed a little bit better, but 10 meters has not been really good on the phone this, this year. Okay, we are tying a bow on field day 2024. I think we ended up with about 1,500 or so contacts. I might adjust that, but uh, had a good time with our three alpha station here with the Columbus Amateur Radio Club. I think the heat this year kind of deterred a few people from coming out. We didn't have quite the numbers, but we had a good time. Made a lot of contacts and uh, played a lot of radio, but this is the the time we've been looking for everything's packed down except the last few things i think we bought 35 two liters too many of soft drinks nobody was drinking soft drinks too hot this year but anyways hope you got something out of that i'm steve 84 xt for ham radio portable 73